Good morning. Good morning. How are you? Good. What are you doing? You're not eating breakfast, okay. Good morning, Mowgli. Hi. What are you doing? Playing video games. Who said you could do that? Mommy, I asked her. Okay. TV, huh? Good morning, Mommy. Good morning, princess. I'm not a princess. I just like my sleep. We shall call you Sleeping Beauty. Yeah. Sleeping daddy. I like my sleep. Plus, today we're not doing anything until after lunch. Good morning. We're going bowling today. Today is not as eventful as yesterday. Dad. We're going bowling. And we're going to go play the park, probably. And that's all we have on the agenda for today. But we're going to have fun. We take a break from this regularly scheduled vlog to teach you how to make a delicious sandwich while on vacation. This is a delicious turkey sandwich. <laughs> what are you laughing at? I'm being mocked. You can't see it, but there's two little children over here making fun of me <laughs> for saying I'm going to make a video about making a delicious turkey sandwich because that's exactly what I'm going to do. What's so funny? What's so funny? I really am going to make a delicious turkey sandwich. So this is what you're going to need for a delicious turkey sandwich. You're going to need some mayonnaise. You're gonna need some bread. You're gonna need some turkey, of course. Oop. You're gonna need some cheese. I've got Swiss cheese and a red onion. And then the secret ingredient is balsamic vinegar. All right, so first up, you need to prepare your onion. Red onions are the best for said sandwiches, so cut off the ends and get this thing ready. All right, so cut up some onions so that you have a couple rings like this. That's about all you need. So here's the steps to make a delicious turkey sandwich. First of all, you need some bread. And if it's nice, dense bread, it works a little bit better. We have Grandma Sycamore's bread here. So you just put two slices down like that. Then take your secret ingredient, the balsamic vinegar. And you just sprinkle a little bit on the bread. Oh, that's a lot. Oh, that's a lot. Maybe a little too much. You can kind of, you can kind of mix it together like that. Okay, I've made a mess. Clearly, I'm not a professional sandwich maker. Then, get yourself some mayonnaise. Put some mayonnaise. I like lots of mayonnaise, so I'm going to put it on both sides. Just spread that over the balsamic vinegar. That's what really gives it the flavor. And what we're gonna do is put some red onion on here. Put as little or as much as you want. Then get your delicious turkey. We have cracked black pepper turkey. Just put, again, as much or as little as you want. And then you get your cheese, which in this case is Swiss. And add yourself a nice piece of cheese. One should be plenty, unless it's really thinly cut. And then the most important spot, or step, is to just close your sandwich, like so. If you'd like, cut it down the middle. And there you have a delicious turkey sandwich. The end. The end. Hello, okay, I'm going to show you how to make a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. So first you need your ingredients, cotton, jelly, peanut butter, and you also need a nut. Well, and a plate. Oh, and, uh, and bread. <laughs> okay, so the first thing you do is get two pieces of bread out. Okay. Then... You put pan butter on one with a knife. Mm -hmm. 
then with the jelly, I need to put it on the other side. Oh. And my dad is helping me. Thanks, Dad. Where's the jelly? Then you put two pieces of bread together, and then and finally you put it in your face. Um, that's how to make a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Bye. I hope you guys feel educated now that you have learned how to make two absolutely delicious gourmet sandwiches. Uh. One is, is gourmet and one is a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. <laughs> They're both gourmet, Liam. Come what on. does gourmet mean? It means fancy delicious. But it's this yeah. isn't fancy. <laughs> um, it's just a, it just has peanut butter and jelly on it. I Did see. Dad, can I have some um, uh, chips, please? Of course you can. Hey. Who's ready to go bowling? Hello. You ready to go, Liam? Yeah, yeah I haven't been bowling in a long, We haven't been bowling in a, pre, in a pretty mm. long time. I know. You ready to, yeah. to bowl some strikes, Aiden? Yeah! All right. All right, so change of plans. We attempted to go bowling, and there is a senior citizens bowling tournament going on to like six tonight. So we have scrapped bowling. Whether or not we get to go on this trip, uh, we don't know yet. Um, so we have been driving around town looking at all the parks. There's a lot of parks here and we find found one that looked kind of fun for the kids. So we're going to stay here and play for a while. You went too soon. Sorry. Show me how you got up there. I went up this thing. Okay, show me. Were you walking? Yeah. Are you tired now? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Can you sit up big? Yeah. Did you get an ouchie? How'd you get that? Mom. Oh, mom's got a band aid for you. Say thanks, mom. Oh, there, now you look like you've been boxing. Okay, okay. Oh, is that a Paw Patrol Band-Aid? Yeah. yeah. That's awesome. What are you doing? Um, I'm playing at the playground. Oh, did you think I was taking your picture? Uh, yeah. I wasn't, I was doing video of you. Hey, show me how you climb that thing. Yeah, do it. Yeah, do it.
So in lieu of not going bowling now on this trip, um, we decided to venture to Walmart again. What'd we get, Liam? We got treatsies. Treatsies, and what else? Sanitizer, no. <laughs> what else did we get? What are we gonna do tonight? Um, we're gonna watch a movie. We got, we got two movies. Um, I, I uh, the one, uh, one of them that, um, <laughs> We got was like a one that I got. It was Detective Pikachu. Detective Pikachu, and then we got the one with Jack Black, the clocks in the walls, or something like that. I saw the trailer a long time ago. And it looked interesting. So we we picked two movies from the five dollar bin. <laughs> but somebody didn't tell somebody that they wanted ice cream and root beer. She wants ice cream and root beer, and she tells me as we're walking out of the store, fail. Mostly because I didn't think about it until we were checking out and we have enough treatsies. Anyway, we're going to go back to the condo and just have a chill evening. We're going to order Cafe Rio and I'll go pick that up in a little bit and then we'll just watch movies and have fun. Good day. You give me a scowl and then good you say good day. day. Good, good day, day sir. Cat. It's dinner time. We got Cafe Rio tonight for dinner. Cafe Rio. Boys are having quesadillas and chips and rice and beans. <laughs> Funny enough, the kids' meals don't come with rice and beans, just one or the other. Uh, and that's why Aiden's having two, you're having a quesadilla. Uh, no. And mom got some tortilla soup. No. Uh, and we got some chips and queso. No. <laughs> and this little kid is being a grumpy Gus. Are you a grumpy Gus? Maybe we brought the wrong kid home. All right, dinner is over. Everybody is chilling. Chilling, chilling, chilling. Liam is playing with his new Legos. Um, if you enjoy Legos, Liam has his own YouTube channel. It's called Liam's Legos. Um, if you go to our main channel page, towards the bottom there is a link to his channel. We just put up short little Lego builds that he likes to do whenever we are able to get a set. And that's something he does. We weren't really, we're not really promoting it. It's just something fun that he and I do together. Um, you know, comments are disabled. They're made for kids so that they show up on YouTube Kids. So if you have a kid that's looking for, you know, kid-friendly videos, check out Liam's Legos. Um, there's no ads, at least we're, we, we, we don't put ads on them. You know, there's no money being made off of it, it's just strictly for fun. And my wife is making funny faces at me. Anyway, we're gonna have a movie night now. I'm actually gonna turn on the jazz game. And we're gonna have a chill evening. Liam, what did you just do? What did you just watch on the TV? Um, Detective Pikachu. Detective Pikachu, how was it? It was good. Yeah. I see you've crash landed your X-Wing. Um, and Poe Dameron is missing his legs. Oh no, they're just really dark. <laughs> and we got a mommy with a little Aiden. Aww, sweet little lamb. <laughs> Well, it's been a great day, even though we didn't do a whole lot today. Just played and chilled. What are we going to do tomorrow? Tomorrow, we are going to go to the Valley of Fire. No. Same thing we do every day. Try, Try to, to take, take over, over the world. world. No, we're going to go to the Valley of Fire. And on that note, we are going to end today's video. Thank you for joining us, and stay tuned for tomorrow's video. Peace.